Hi guys, magandang umaga sa lahat. This is our new channel, the Faithful Hope Adventure. So for today, we have a new adventure here. We are we are here in our garden. It's spring here in United States. So we have a little garden here. I can call this is a little mini farm. So every day we can harvest. This is a kale. I tell you a little short story about kale. Um. Two years ago, when the pandemic is, you know, when the pandemic is locked down everything, I got a uh, mastitis in my right breast almost every month. So, mastitis is not a pleasurable experience. It's so painful, very, very painful through the whole body. That we know our breast is many kind of nodes and many kind of muscles that connecting to our body. So, that mastitis is killing me. So, it's an infection. Because I was breastfeeding to my son, so every time I keep on, he keep on sucking my left side of my breast, it having a mastitis. One, one, one day there is a pus in my, my breast, you know, something like that. So I was afraid, um, I was afraid to go to the doctor because that time it's pandemic, maybe we are going to be contracted of that kind of something like, you know, the problem of the society. So, so what I did, I keep on searching online what are the food to fight infection. So one of this, one of this uh, food, one of this vegetable is kale. So I kind of curious about that. Before I don't wanna to, I don't want to to eat that this kind of vegetable because the taste is not pleasurable it's not it's not really like anybody will like this taste okay so it's kind of i like malungay you know malungay is good and there are very tiny leaves but it's very super greens so while i'm studying about this kind of vegetable i kind of curious my mind you know at that time i'm having a uh infection of my breast so i don't want to go there to my doctor of course if there's something an infection to your body it's need to be treated so what uh, so of course they will give you the antibiotic or whatsoever is that so in my case i didn't there are four times again when i'm not mistaken four times i'm having that i didn't go there to the doctor um, so what I did guys, I this kind of vegetable, this is a kale. So what I did, we bought kale in the in the supermarket, which is organic. Three not $3.99. Almost four dollar. It's quite expensive, about um almost three hundred pesos or two hundred and fifty pesos. So yun guys, ang ginawa ko ay Every day, umiinom ako ng kale. Yung ginagawa ko siyang shake, guys. Hinahaluan ko siya ng banana, kale, and green apple. Yun ang aking kinakain palagi. So, to make the story short, nawala yung aking infection sa aking breast. So, yun, nawala yung mastitis. So, now, until now, it's 2022. Wala na siya. It's, wala na yung ano... So, pina-stop ko na sa aking son na mag-breastfeed sa kanya. So, anyway, wala na yun. So, yun, um, naisipan kong magtanim ng maraming kale, guys. So, ito rin ay very super food, foods, super greens. Ang ganda-ganda niya, guys. Um, to tell you a little story, this one, papano ako nakakuha ng seeds nito. Way back, five years ago, when I came here to United States, we always going to the library. In the library, there are so many um, seeds in the library. It's free. So, I found the seeds of kale. So, I just saw that. So, I nag-start akong magtanim ng mga kale. So, yun. Uh, ito ngayon, yung mga produce ng kale ko is galing ito sa aking, nag-umpisa lang ako sa dalawa, dalawang buto ng kale. So, tumubo yun, so tinanim ko siya, tapos nag-start ako, tapos nagbunga siya, I mean, namulaklak siya. Uh, in fact, ipapakita ko sa inyo yung mga bulaklak. So, anyway, napaka, uh, ano siya, napaka-powerful siyang greens, guys. Okay, yun ang aking maishishare sa inyo. Kaya, marami akong ganito. So, I diligently uh, making my garden like this i think for this year um 
ay supposed to be wala pa akong tanim ngayon. It's nag-uumpisa pa lang ako magtanim ng mga May. So ngayon, nagpapasalamat ako kay Lord kasi binigyan niya ako ng maraming ganito kasi December pa lang bago mag winter, I work hard na sa aking garden, guys. So nakikita natin ngayon, ito ay bunga ng aking pag-work hard. So every day, guys, <laughs> ang ganda-ganda ng ganda-ganda ng ibon. So every day, guys, nagtatanim ako ng mga every day talaga. Halos every day I planted everything. So ito nakikita natin ito kahapon ko lang ito tinanim. So hindi lang mga green kasi last five last four years yung mga tanim ko palagi yung mga mga fruitable meaning yung mga fruit vegetable like squash mainly mga squash so ngayon i i feel amazed kasi mayroon din tayong mga mayroon din tayong mga different